Hello. Some of the top browsers, such as Internet Explorer and Firefox, have enacted security measures to block what's called mixed content in the browser. And that can sometimes cause trouble for links if you have a link, for example, in your Angel course out to either a publisher site or some outside external website. Now there are a few options for uh, correcting these links to allow students to easily access them. And one of those options is by using the link tool and just a little bit of HTML code when you set up the link in Angel. To do this, go into your course in Angel, click on the Lessons tab, and then click on Add Content. Under Add Content, click on the Link tool. You'll be taken to the settings area for your new link. You're going to focus on the title field in this new link settings area. You're going to start by typing a little bit of HTML code, starting with a lesser than sign. Okay? Then you're going to type in A space HREF equals and a quotation mark. Okay? Once you've typed the quotation mark, go to the website to which you're linking. So in this case, I'm going to link to the Pearson website. Select the URL or the address for the site, right click, and copy. Go back into your course, right click, and paste that address after the quotation mark, and then type another, a closing quotation mark. Put in a space, and then type target equals underscore blank and the greater than sign. Okay. Now this next part is important. This is what your students are actually going to see. They don't see any of this. This just allows this to work. Um, this is the text that they're actually going to click on. They're going to see in the course. So you want to be descriptive with it. Okay. So I'm just going to type in publisher website. Okay. And the last thing I need to do is type in a lesser than sign slash a greater than sign. Okay, so this is what your link should look like. If we scroll down and click save, we can skip everything else. Okay, now when we click on the link, the page opens in a new window.